Hello dear viewer, Assalamu alaikum. I am Engineer Muhammad Rezaul Haq. Welcome to my Automation Tools YouTube channel. Today I will show how to configure a hardware that means a input output card, power supply card, Profibus DP in Siemens S7300 PLC. So let's start. First we open the Schematic Manager software that are used for configuration of S7300 oblique 400 PLC you see software is open then you go to the new press the new button and here press the name the name of this project I name uh, write this project name is hardware configuration then press ok then you go to the click select hardware and go to uh, go to insert object I want to configure 300 so select schematic stations 300 then you go to the project mode go to the CPU section here you can see the hardware double click to hardware now hardware interface is opening our main object is to configure the hardware system of S7300 PLC so hardware is opened now I show you step by step how to configure the hardware of S7300 PLC first we have to be insert the rack because all the IO card CPU or power supply are have to be insert in rack so first we insert rack system then we select the slot first slot you have to be first slot you have to be supply power supply so we push the uh, insert the power supply in first slot and second slot we have insert we have to insert the CPU because power supply then CPU then the others input output card so I second slot I insert the CPU here the different types of model you can in, uh, choose the uh, model of as per your hardware model number here if you have been profibus system so if you have to be insert new and the profibus and press ok you see when you select and press ok there has a line for the profibus system here if you not select this one the profibus system will not be inserted you can select it or not as, a, as per your requirement if you need then you can select this now here I insert the Profibus uh, communication module that I here I use the IM 153 so I am inserting this IM 153 you see press hold and release here you press ok then you see the Profibus rack is showing in the program by hardware system here you can insert the now I will show you the configuration or insertion of hardware step by step one slot I press select slot and go to the IM here you can see the CPU uh, here you can see the hardware module from here first uh, we first we select the DO card digital input then the digital output then the analog input then another output first I select and insert on the digital input then I select the digital output card our system is 24 volt so I, I am inserting all the cards as for 24 volt I insert another uh, I am inserting another IO card of digital output you see I have insert digital output you see I am inserting another digital output card if you need the uh, uh, more than the one you have to be insert one by one if you can insert the output card I mean IO card as per your requirement if you need two three four or five so you have to insert one by one 
but you have to be uh, mind that you have to be uh, notice that you first you have to be digital input and you have to be maintain the sequence you see here is an warning because I have break the sequence because I wanted to the another uh, digital input card but I have already input the digital output card so here is the no uh, 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 sequence have not been maintained here so it is showing the warning first I have to be first I have to be input the slot so I am emptying that means uh, uh, empty the slot then I can easily insert the another digital input card you see I have make this uh, slot empty and <coughs> insert the another digital input you see select and press and hold and release press hold and release you see I have inserted that is the sequence of break for that I cannot insert in the card now I have insert already I have already insert two digital input digital two, two digital output now I am inserting the analog output card you see this analog in sorry analog input card then I I have I have insert I have, now I am inserting analog output card I have insert an analog output card after inserting you can see the here you see the address of this input output card you can also change this input output card as per your requirement or as per your uh, as per your wish I am showing that the how to uh, change the address of an analog input card it is the system default if you want to change you have to be uh, remove system default and then you can change this value you see I have system remove remove system default and now it is active and I am changing if I go to system default it automatically go to there uh, the, the default system so I have to if, if, if you have changed the input I have also changed the output so um, change and ok you said here is the change the address or default address is already changed here you also you can insert the input output card in profibus module you see I am select the profibus module so I am inserting the one of the digital input card for your understanding I have already insert and now I am to show I now want to download this system in the virtual CPU so I open the simulation tag and go to the hardware that means I want to download this hardware in the virtual CPU I will show if the our uh, hardware configuration is correctly or not so you see you see I am downloading this hardware system to the virtual CPU that means the simulation CPU now press the download button and see here is here you can see the CPU press view you can see the CPU then press ok then our hardware is downloaded to the virtual CPU now go to the online I want to see the module is showing ok or not it is going to online you see I press the CPU in run mode because with the run mode I cannot see the actual data of this hardware system so we also run mode it and go to the CPU and you see this module is available and ok no LED are no that means no alarm in this CPU that means CPU is ok I show the another input output card that already I configured you see module is available and ok that means our configuration is 100% ok and the, all the module are showing is module is available and ok this status is only showing when that is the ok dear friend in this way you can easily configure the hardware as per your requirement so if you like my video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon also like comments and share thanks for watching